Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. I'm here with your champion for the 2022 Roland Martin Marine Center Series. The championship was this weekend. Jared Boltz, John Bowman from Sarasota, two fish and studs, and they won $35,000 for first place. They had a two-day total of 47.44 pounds. They absolutely slayed them and they beat a murderer's row of the best fishing teams in the state of Florida, possibly the Southeast United States. That's how we do it. We're in Clouston, Florida, on Lake Okeechobee. I'm gonna get all their smoke, all their scoop. I want to know everything, what they did, what they were using, what they're thinking. These guys' hearts are beating. Their blood pressure is probably off the hook. They just literally went through it hardcore. So we're going to talk to him. We're going to get all the info. First of all, congratulations, Appreciate Jared, it, John. Thank you. Awesome. And what's it mean to you to take thirty-five thousand dollars home before Christmas? It means a lot, man. It's pretty special, especially you know competing with these kind of guys out here and, and being able to bring that home. Is and you did cool, you man. did it pretty good, man. Yeah. What's it mean to you? Thirty-five grand. It means a lot. Right I mean, before Christmas. Right before Christmas. <laughs> pretty I, awesome. Yeah, I couldn't ask for a better year. That's for sure. And you're beat. Like I said, a murderer's row of studs. You guys came out on top of some really, really tough competition. Did you think that you had it in, in the bag today, or were you just waiting for someone to take you out? Oh, I, I just knew that somebody was going to take us out. I didn't think we had it at all. You weighed in pretty early today. Yeah, we was first to make flight, sure right? Fish first flight? Yeah, and actually yesterday, I mean, we were out there, and I had some problems with my live well. My battery died on me. My timer for my uh, research switch went out on me, so it was just r constantly running. So I'd, we had issues with that. So we were a little worried about them fish today. So they were outside our top ten. They had just under 18 pounds. They really did not have a chance statistically, except for we're on the greatest lake in the world, Lake Okeechobee. So they had five fish for 29 and a half pounds. Mega bag, dude. That is sick, bro. Yeah, Did you know sick. you had almost 30? Yeah. yeah you, we, you knew it was big. Yeah. And you anchored that with an 815, so almost an eight and a quarter pound. Beautiful fish. What did you catch that big girl on? He caught it on a uh, black and blue chatterbait. Black and blue chatterbait? Are you in the back of the boat? Are you the yeah. guy in the back mostly? In the back. So your man's in the back. Hooks a big one? Yeah. Were you freaking out? Oh, yeah. Were you freaking? <laughs> did you see her jump? Never jumped, showed her mouth one time, and we knew it was a good one, didn't realize how good it was. What did the other 20 pounds of fish come on today? Uh, chatterbait. All day? Yeah. All Every day. one of our fish today came on a chatterbait. What about yesterday? Yesterday, speed worm, uh, June bug speed worm. We flipped a little bit, cattails. Uh, I missed a good one in the cattails yesterday flipping. Um, but yeah, did pretty you much, see her? Yeah, no, I didn't see her. She just. You were thinking Angry about it. It took off, man. Yeah. Had you nervous last night? Oh, yeah. I so, wish. you said something different to me <clears throat> about your chatterbait setup. You're straight fluorocarbon, right? Yeah. What's your man throwing here? Uh, 50 pound braid. 50 pound braid on your chatterbait, bro. I know I'm yeah. spilling secrets, but talk. <laughs> nobody's doing that, dude. Why? Uh, to be honest with you, I mean, he, he picked up the rod with the mono, and I just. Kept on. We most of our poles have braid on them, so I just that's something I like. You I just like. tied the bait on and went. And the first thing this morning, we pulled up to our spot, and I cracked a six right off the bat, and I said, "Man, we need to put another chowder bait on." Caught another six, and so we had we had twenty nine pounds at eight o'clock this morning. What does it feel like when a six pounder engulfs a bait like that? Uh, does it awesome, just man. stop? Oh yeah. Wow, dude. Yeah, it was cool. Man. What did you do to have your almost 18 pounds yesterday? What was your technique? That yesterday, we pretty much threw a speed worm all day and flipped. Um, totally different than today. Yeah, we were up tight on a hard wall, just throwing that, throwing a chatterbait and a speed worm, but they weren't hitting that chatterbait yesterday. And then going outside a little bit, flipping those cattails. And I, I yesterday the spot we were in, we we really thought we had a, we could have pulled a good bag out of there, but it just didn't produce yesterday. That's awesome. So, what kind of boat do you run and motor? Uh, I got a tri 21 foot Triton nice. with a 225 EFI on it. Were you making a long run? Yeah. All the way to the north end? Oh, yeah. <laughs> what type of vegetation were you looking for? What were you fishing? Uh, we were pretty much fishing dead cattails. It, it was <laughs> really? the ugliest, nastiest 
thing that you would have never thought that we'd catch fish in like a... Was there any bottom grass down there? Just muck. muck. What? <laughs> yeah. muck. You, that's not what you should have done. You shouldn't yeah. have even practiced there. Yeah. That, well, that, and yesterday when we were fishing, I mean, we were trying to fish hydrilla and, you know, flip buggy whips. and Yeah. And so. Do you think going against the grain helped you stand out amongst this crowd? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it showed today, that's for sure. <laughs> so, a weekend tournament trail that is basically gives you pro level opportunities. You're a weekend angler, got a normal job in Sarasota. Yeah. What does it mean to you to fish this trail? What do you think about the Roland Martin Trail? And what would you invite people, what would you say to invite them to our trail? I, I mean, I love it. This is my first year. and uh, First year you're a champion. Oh, yeah. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> and, Jared, and Jared's my cousin. So they, he, he asked me to fish with him this year. and. I said, yeah, and we we had a tough we had a tough year. I mean, it's been many years since I've actually fished Okeechobee. I used to fish it a lot, and then I kind of got away from it and did nothing but air boating, and then kind of wanted to get back. And Jared asked me if I wanted to uh, fish with him this year, and I couldn't turn it down. Well, you're glad you didn't, because he would put that anchor fish in there. Yeah. For Same sure. question for you. You've been around a little longer with us. You fished the Roland Martin Marine Center Series. You know the opportunities. You also know the murderer's row of guys out oh, there. Yeah. So, one, tell us what this trail means, what you think about the money, and two, what would you say to invite people to come and fish with us? It's cool, man. I mean, it just you guys giving out this amount of money, you know, for a tournament like this is awesome, and I enjoy fishing it. I like everybody that I fish with and around, and everybody's just, you know, cool with each other, and and it's, it's an awesome tournament to fish, so I, I would say it's a good one to join nice brotherhood right yeah for sure is it pretty cool to fish against guys that you almost want to ask for their autograph oh yeah that's yeah, pretty yeah, neat right i mean yeah, come yeah, on man you've got we've got hall of famers it's pretty oh, pretty yeah. sick right yeah so definitely an awesome accomplishment we're really proud of you guys um no sponsors yet so sponsors if you're out there obviously we've got a team <laughs> more than capable and well qualified come and check them out you said you have tiktok facebook something where can we find you online uh I have TikTok 2120, or no, 2121, I'm sorry. Okay, 2121. And, uh, my Facebook is John Bowman. Uh, I mostly put everything on my TikTok. Uh, so mainly, we, can, we mainly, can check you out yeah, there? Yeah, you can check me out. I got all kinds of videos on there. I'm Tips? Probably. Secret spots? No, I kind of keep those out. <laughs> so you're teaching them right, cuz. <laughs> you don't fish with me, cuz. Uh. Can't be talking, right? Right. Pretty awesome. The fact that it's a family thing is even more special. We have father sons, husband wives, father daughters. This is a pretty special tournament trail that you can do that. I couldn't be more proud. I'm here with some really normal weekend anglers that just smacked down a field of studs and came out on top earning it with a two day total of 47.44 pounds. That's about a 23 and a half pound average for two days. That's a bag of somebody's life. We're here in Clewiston, Florida at Roland and Marion Martin's Marine Center and Resort. And we're here with your 2022 champions for the Roland Martin Marine Center Series. Man, that's a lot to say, but what I love saying, my champions, Jared Boltz, John Bowman, $35,000 richer, and they will remember this day for the rest of their life. Nobody can take this away from them. They earned it. I'm so proud of you guys. Congratulations. Thank you, man. Check us out on YouTube. Check your boy out here on TikTok. Sponsor my homies here because they deserve it. And we will see you next year for the 2023 Roland Martin Marine Center Series. Peanut out.